yes, we expect James Webb to make great discoveries. We expect that. When the scientists at NASA designed and developed the James Webb Space Telescope, they hoped that it would improve our understanding of the universe and help us to peer into the obscurity of space. But little did they know that this super telescope was going to uncover what many had feared for decades. Only moments ago, while staring at a black hole, the James Webb Telescope spotted an enigmatic spacecraft. The capturing of this collision course with destiny might have catapulted the James Webb Telescope into legendary status, but it has sent the astronomy world into a panic. What is the X-7 spacecraft? Why is it headed towards a black hole? Could black holes serve as cosmic gateways to unimaginable feats of computation and communication? One of the defining characteristics of the cosmos is that it is an endless expanse of space. For centuries, humans have been intrigued by and interested in the mysteries of the universe. Our desire to unlock the mysteries of the universe has led us to invent engineering marvels that are a beacon of our technological advancement and scientific achievements. One of such engineering marvels in space exploration is the James Webb Space Telescope. It is the latest in a long line of space telescopes and observatories. The Hubble Space Telescope was one of the predecessors of the James Webb Telescope. Launched in 1990, it is one of the most famous and influential telescopes. It helped us to understand many things about the universe, including the expansion rate. Another important telescope is the Spitzer Space Telescope, launched in 2003. It was useful for observing cool objects such as brown dwarfs and studying the formation of stars. In 2009, the Kepler Space Telescope was designed to survey a portion of the Milky Way galaxy and discover planets orbiting other stars. Another is the Fermi Gamma Ray Space Telescope, which studied space phenomena like pulsars. James Webb stands out from all the telescopes launched before now. The journey to the James Webb Telescope started with a bold vision to push the boundaries of space exploration and expand our understanding of the universe. It was conceived as the successor to the iconic Hubble Space Telescope, drawing inspiration from the successes and challenges of previous space missions. The JWST was designed to overcome the limitations of its predecessors and pave the way for groundbreaking discoveries in astronomy and astrophysics. After years of meticulous planning, development and testing, the telescope was ready to be launched. In December 2021, the James Webb Telescope began its voyage on an Ariane 5 rocket. Unlike its predecessor, the telescope was optimized to observe the universe in infrared light, allowing it to peer through cosmic dust clouds and capture images of celestial objects that may have been hidden to other telescopes. One of its primary objectives was to study the formation and evolution of galaxies. This would shed light on the process that led to the birth of our universe as we know it by observing distant objects in the early universe. The telescope will provide invaluable insight into the galaxies, stars, and planetary systems in our universe. The James Webb Telescope is also equipped with advanced instruments to study exoplanets, which are planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. By analyzing the atmospheres of these distant worlds, scientists hope to uncover clues about their composition, climate, and potential habitability, laying the groundwork for future exploration of alien worlds. One of the most remarkable capabilities of the JWST is its ability to capture images of distant objects in the early universe. With its advanced instruments, including the near-infrared camera, and the mid-infrared instrument, the telescope can detect faint signals from celestial objects that are billions of light years away. This allows astronomers to study the universe's most ancient structures, from the first galaxies that formed after the Big Bang to the remnants of ancient supernovae. Arguably the most awe-inspiring aspect of the James Webb technology is its ability to witness the birth of stars and planetary systems. With a large primary mirror measuring 21 feet in diameter, the telescope can collect more light than its predecessor. This enables it to observe the faint emissions of young stars embedded within dense clouds of gas and dust. By studying these stellar nurseries, 
astronomers can gain insight into the processes that govern star formation, from the collapse of molecular clouds to the formation of protostellar disks and the birth of planetary systems. These advancements have not only expanded our understanding of the universe, but have paved the way for future discoveries. The telescope comes with sensitivity and resolution and is poised to unveil new insights into the nature of dark matter, the dynamics of galaxy evolution, and the search for potentially habitable planets. Bill Nelson, the NASA administrator, stated that the James Webb Space Telescope is indeed an incredible feat in engineering. With the telescope's ability to explore ancient galaxies and peer into the cosmos, we can now see the structure of the galaxies that existed a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. Before this telescope, this was thought to be an impossible feat. Understanding these cosmic relics challenges our understanding of the galaxy formation, and there are already indications that the galaxy had more galaxies earlier than we predicted. This has shattered all known models about galaxies. This discovery ignited many new scientific inquiries, prompting researchers to reconsider the mechanisms driving cosmic evolution. Scientists have also been forced to study the role of dark matter in shaping the cosmic landscape. Dark matter is seen as the invisible force that silently governs the intricate movements of celestial bodies. Scientists and astronomers have been captivated by this elusive phenomenon for years. A proper understanding of this force holds the key to unlocking the deepest secrets of the cosmos. It is known that dark matter exerts a profound influence on the structure and evolution of galaxies, prompting us to question the fabric of our existence. The discovery of dark matter was a product of decades of meticulous observations and cutting-edge technology. We understand that galaxies behave in ways that defy our current understanding of gravitational dynamics. Their motions and structures suggest the presence of an invisible, undetected mass that outweighs the visible matter we can observe. The implications of dark matter's existence are profound and far-reaching. Dark matter's gravitational influence acts as a cosmic scaffold, shaping the large-scale structure of the universe and dictating the formation and distribution of galaxies throughout the cosmos. Dark matter may hold the key to unraveling the mysteries surrounding the formation of the first stars and galaxies in the early universe. It is thought that these primordial celestial bodies emerged from the gravitational seeds sown by the fluctuation of dark matter's density. Ambitious experiments and cutting-edge particle accelerators have been designed to detect and study the elusive particles that may constitute dark matter. Sophisticated simulations and theoretical models are also in place to shed light on its properties and behaviors. It is important to note that the pursuit of dark matter is not merely an academic endeavor, but holds profound implications. This is why the James Webb Telescope has provided unprecedented insights into the enigmatic world of dark matter and supermassive black holes. Just by studying the gravitational lensing effects provided by distant black holes, the telescope has revealed that there were supermassive black holes in the early universe. This was far earlier than anyone had anticipated. With this information, the scientific world is buzzing with questions about the origins of these cosmic giants and their role in shaping the evolution of galaxies. We also know more about the process that drives the growth and evolution of supermassive black holes. This has offered new avenues for exploration into the nature of these cosmic mysteries. Black holes are these enigmatic entities with masses millions and billions of times that of our sun. They exert a gravitational pull so strong that not even light can escape their grasp. While many theories suggest that these cosmic giants formed from the collapse of massive gas clouds in the early universe, the James Webb Telescope is on a journey to uncover their true origins. Another prevailing theory suggests that black holes formed from extreme density fluctuations of infant cosmos that gradually accumulate mass through accretion. These bodies further merged with other black holes to eventually grow into a supermassive hole. According to observations made by the James Webb Telescope, this theory might have some truth to it. The observations revealed the presence of supermassive black holes dating back just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. This is a major shift 
in our understanding of black hole formation. It also suggests that black holes play a pivotal role in the early evolution of galaxies. Moreover, the JWST has uncovered the intricate interplay between supermassive black holes and the galaxies that host them. When matter, such as stars and gas, comes within the gravitational reach of a supermassive black hole, it undergoes a process called accretion. This forms a swirling disk of hot gas and dust, known as an accretion disk. As matter falls into the black hole, it releases enormous amounts of energy in the form of radiation and powerful jets of particles. These jets of particles shape the surrounding environment and have a major impact on the growth of the galaxy. The influence of supermassive black holes extends beyond their immediate vicinity and can affect the formation of stars and the evolution of galaxies on cosmic scales. It is also noteworthy that the intense radiation and energetic outflows produced by these cosmic giants can heat the gas within galaxies. When these gases are heated up, the formation of new stars is inhibited, which can alter the overall structure of the galaxy. These outflows can also trigger the formation of stars in other regions of the galaxy. This means that there is a constant interplay of black holes and stellar birth. Beyond black holes and dark matter, the James Webb Telescope has revolutionized our understanding of star formation and the birth of planetary systems. By capturing images of stellar nurseries and protostellar disks, the telescope has provided unprecedented insights into the processes that govern the formation of stars and planets. At the center of our understanding of the universe, our world began with the Big Bang. This theory is the fundamental framework that unlocks the intricate timeline of our universe's evolution. According to this theory, there was a single point of inconceivable density and energy where the fabric of space and time was born. Approximately 13.8 billion years ago, this singular event marked the beginning of our universe as we know it. In a fraction of a second, this primordial fireball expanded at an astonishing rate, setting the stage for the grand symphony that continues to unfold to this day. Scientists state that as the universe cooled and expanded, the initial chaos gave way to order, and the first subatomic particles emerged, forging the building blocks of matter. These particles, bound by the fundamental forces of nature, coalesced into the first atomic nuclei, and eventually, the first atoms took shape, their delicate dance governed by the laws of quantum mechanics. Moments after the Big Bang, the first ephemeral flash of light illuminated the cosmos. This would eventually lead to stars and galaxies that would later lead to human civilization. These particles, bound by the fundamental forces of nature, coalesced into the first atomic nuclei, and eventually, the first atoms took shape, their delicate dance governed by the laws of quantum mechanics. After a few billion years, matter and energy became intertwined, and remnants of primordial fireballs coalesced, igniting the first stars and forging the heavy elements that would later become planets. Scientists spent decades discovering and developing this timeline until James Webb's telescope came to rewrite things with its groundbreaking discoveries. The discovery that black holes and galaxies were in the epochs of the universe has challenged the foundation of cosmological theories. The JWST's observations have cast doubt on this linear narrative, revealing cosmic entities that seem to defy the conventional timeline. These primordial cosmic behemoths challenge the notion that galaxies formed gradually over billions of years, suggesting instead that galaxies were already in existence shortly after the universe's birth. This discrepancy raises profound questions about the timeline of cosmic evolution and the mechanisms driving galaxy formation. Also, according to conventional wisdom, supermassive black holes form through the gradual accretion of matter over cosmic timescales. However, the presence of supermassive black holes shortly after the Big Bang suggests a more rapid and enigmatic process of black hole formation, challenging our understanding of the cosmic order. These revelations have sent shockwaves through the scientific community, prompting a re-evaluation of existing cosmological theories. Scientists are grappling with the implications of these findings, seeking to reconcile the new observations with the established frameworks of cosmology. 
One possible explanation for these anomalous discoveries is the existence of alternative models of cosmic evolution. Some theorists propose that the universe underwent periods of rapid growth and expansion, known as cosmic inflation. This phenomenon might have triggered the formation of galaxies and black holes in the early universe. Other scientists suggest that exotic phenomena, such as primordial black holes or dark mat, may have played a role in the early formation of cosmic structures. It was in the midst of this cosmic inquiry that the James Webb Space Telescope stumbled upon a perplexing discovery. A massive object was found hurling towards the center of our galaxy's black hole, sparking speculations of extraterrestrial activity in our galaxy. At the heart of our galaxy is a supermassive black hole, which constantly sucks in matter and other materials. The James Webb Telescope detected a giant anomalous object on a collision course with the black hole. The spacecraft was named X-7 and has been shrouded in mystery. X-7 has captured the imagination of scientists and stargazers alike, with many speculations. Some scientists believe that this is an alien spaceship with the ability to perform quantum computing. The aliens might just have cracked this level of computing. This would explain why they can fly through black holes at incredible speed. While classic computers operate on the principles of binary logic, manipulating bits of information, quantum computers exploit the quantum mechanical properties of subatomic particles. These properties include superposition and entanglement to perform calculations simultaneously across multiple states. This quantum mechanical approach opens up a vast realm of computational power, exponentially surpassing the capabilities of even the most advanced classical computers. By harnessing the quantum realm, these extraordinary machines possess the potential to solve problems that would take conventional computers billions of years to unravel. Doing this will unlock new frontiers in many fields, from cryptography and materials, science to drug discovery and climate modeling. The advent of quantum computing has implications that transcend the realms of science and technology. By harnessing the power of these extraordinary machines, we may one day witness the emergence of artificial general intelligence. Imagine intelligent systems capable of learning, reasoning, and problem solving at a level that surpasses human cognitive abilities, ushering in a new era of innovation and discovery. This is what many scientists believe is in the alien spacecraft known as X-7. One can only imagine the capabilities of that civilization. However, most scientists do not believe that X-7 is a spacecraft. In fact, for two decades, scientists have observed an elongated object named X-7 near the supermassive black hole at the center of the Milky Way and wondered what it was. They could not tell if it was pulled off a larger structure nearby or stellar winds. Astronomers from the UCLA Galactic Center Group specializing in the Orbit Initiative have dedicated time to studying the object X-7. Over time, they reported that X-7 had stretched and been apart as the black hole dragged it closer, exerting tidal force on it. If this is an alien spaceship, it could go into the black hole and never reappear. It is said that X-7 has a mass of about 50 Earth and is on an orbital path that would take 170 years to complete. The scientists at the Keck Observatory proposed that it could be a cloud of dust and gas that was ejected during the collision of two stars. Scientists believe that in a few decades, X-7 will disintegrate and the gas and dust will eventually be drawn towards the black hole. A UCLA assistant researcher, Anna Curlow, stated that no other object in this region has shown such an extreme evolution. X-7 started comet-shaped, and people thought it got the shape from stellar winds or jets of particles from the black hole. However, upon years of observation, it has become more elongated. Siorlo claims that something must have put this object on this particular path and orientation. It is said that X-7 has a mass of about 50 Earth, and is on an orbital path that would take 170 years to complete. But that might never happen. Based on its trajectory, the team estimates that X-7 will make its closest approach. The experts believe that the strong tidal force of the black hole will tear X-7 apart before it completes its first orbit. X-7 also shows some properties displayed by other strange objects 
orbiting this black hole. This class of objects is called G objects because they look like gas but behave like stars. But X7's shape and velocity have changed more dramatically than G objects. As it accelerates toward the black hole, X7 is moving rapidly, clocking in at speeds of up to around 700 miles per second. While the connection between X7 and quantum computing remains speculative, the discovery has opened Pandora's box of possibilities, igniting discussions about the role of black holes in advanced technological civilizations. It is then self-evident the legacy of the James Webb Telescope shows the intricate dance between galaxies and black holes. We now know the far-reaching consequences of this intricate dance. We know that supermassive black holes have the power to disrupt the delicate balance of the universe with their immense gravitational pull. We also know that they can have an impact on the stars, gas, and dust within galaxies, influencing the rate of star formation and the structure of galactic ecosystems. We know that the voracious appetites of these behemoths can cause large swathes of interstellar materials to be released. These materials can stop the formation of new stars, leading to the end of galaxies. As the JWS continues to peer into the cosmic depths, unraveling the secrets that have eluded us for eons, we are reminded of the profound significance of exploration and scientific inquiry. Each revelation, each anomaly catalyzes human ingenuity, driving us to embrace the unknown and to dare to dream of possibilities that transcend our current comprehension. Thank you for watching another episode of Voyager. While you are still here, click on the video on your screen to see more mind-blowing videos like this one.